what are the Chinese up to now? All right. Uh, I didn't know this, but they can basically tell you how old uh, you need to be to have a boyfriend or a girlfriend. Uh, no, look, this is for their athletes. They're mental about their athletes. They're, and it's almost as if they're a communist country, <laughs> because they are. Uh, you know, Yao Ming, they put like a hundred different restrictions on him. Do you know that when how Yao Ming was born, they put together the tallest male and female athletes in China. And they were waiting on that baby. Like they were expecting it to be a basketball star. What? I mean, they're like, it's like out of a scary sci-fi movie. No way. They basically hatched Yao Ming. All of a sudden, I'm fascinated by Yao Ming. Yeah, isn't that amazing? That is amazing. So now, look. That's kind of cool. In this story, well, <laughs> it's a little, a little spooky also, <laughs> okay, to say the least. In this story, um, they're mental about their ping pong players because, of course, table tennis is huge in China. And they're very proud of how well they do in the nationals. I don't know that anyone outside of China plays ping pong, mm -hmm. so I don't know why they're getting so excited, but... Okay. Now, look, look, I'm kidding. Of course, I play ping pong. A lot of people in America, all over the world play ping pong. But it does seem that the Chinese dominate that, right? <laughs> Just from an outsider's perspective. Anyway, so they got a star ping pong player. Uh -huh. Come on, how does that now sound funny? Okay. But he's, he's a star athlete on their table tennis team. Right. His name is Wang Hao. <laughs> okay. I'm going to let that one go. Okay. <laughs> So, uh, what did they do to Wang Hao? Okay, so uh, back in the day, Wang Hao had a girlfriend by the name of Fan Ying. Of course. Um, and he was not 25 years old. You need to be 25 years old or older if you're an athlete to have a relationship, right? According to the Chinese government. A okay. According to the Chinese government. So, what they did is they broke up the relationship, and uh, Fan Ying was also a ping pong player, and they got rid of her. She was banned from ping pong playing. <laughs> Now, this is so wrong because it's not her fault at all, right? And, but since he's the bigger star, they shipped her back to her province. She was absolutely devastated, crying, etc. But she made a comeback. She got into the ping pong business and uh, she became a ping pong athlete again. A I, after a while, they let her back in mm -hmm. and now she's ranked 19th in the world. Are you a success if you're the 19th best ping pong player in the world? Is I mean, that it's something fun you could put on your resume. What resume? <laughs> <laughs> Imagine you're applying, oh, you're the 19th best female ping pong player in the world. Nicely done. Now, the guy's uh, past 25, so they're, gonna, they're saying, hey, you know what? Uh, we can now let him date. Now, but why, right? Why arbitrarily at 25, you're going to let this poor ping pong someone bitch, <laughs> you know, date, right? Because he was so pent up, he was getting into fights. He started a brawl, okay? And they realized, all oh, right, human beings are supposed to have sex. Otherwise, they, especially guys, otherwise they're like bouncing off the walls. And you don't want a ping pong player bouncing off the walls. So they're like, all right, go ahead. are we not merciful? Are we not merciful? We allow you to have a girlfriend. Right. So, who, who was another ping pong athlete? A ping ponger, if you will. Mm -hmm. And so now they're hitting the ball back and forth at, you know, in their private time. <coughs> <laughs> Oh, speaking of which, they have those ping pong tricks. Oh, but that's a different story. Mm -hmm. All right, anyway. Uh, so now, who I feel bad for is Fan. Okay. Fang Ying or whatever her name was, yeah, right? Yeah, Fan Ying. She got hosed out of all of this. She did. She got sent back home. She had to struggle to get back. She gets back. And finally, they allow the guy to date, but he dates someone else. Mm -hmm. It's not right what they did She to was fan. 17 at the time, though. Mm -hmm. You think she's all right? She'll recover? She's all right. But she still got a while before they let her date someone else. I mean, it sucks that she didn't end up with the number one ping pong champion of China. I mean... Oh, by the way, when the guy got in a fight, he was like, Do you know who I am? I was like, come on, man. You can't pull that card if you're a ping pong champion. He, he got a couple of silvers in the Olympics, mm -hmm. and he has a world championship under his belt. He's like, I'm a champion ping ponger. And then he got into a fight with the bouncer or whatever. Okay, they got something else going on in China. Anyway, like I said, no problem. I love ping pong. Final thought on it is, mm -hmm. the Chinese government, they got to move beyond this. This is madness. You can't be hatching athletes. You can't tell them not to have sex or date anyone until 25. It's beyond all bounds of reason. Mm -hmm. You know? So, Chinese government, okay? If you heard me on that, put some thought behind it. Okay, otherwise, you know, you're going to piss off the Young Turks. I'm sure they care a lot about that.